the most expensive whiskey shot. So please watch until the end to find out all the details about this. Before we start, I'd want you to hit that red subscribe button so that you never miss out on any of our videos. Number one, Macalallan 64 year and Lalique sold for $460,000. Number one, Macalon 64 year and the leak $460,000. This is the oldest single malt whiskey that Macallan has ever sold. It was bottled in incredible one off Lockley C. Purdue. The collaboration came as a part of the global fundraising tour for a charity that is simply called Water. This charity provides clean and safe drinking water to some of the most vulnerable people on the planet. The bottle and its incredibly rare and special contents had been on tours around several cities, including London and Paris, before coming to auction at Southby's in New York in 2010. A lively bid war ensued. In the end, an anonymous philanthropist broke the bank. This is the first stop in this uh, roadshow in Asian market. Globally speaking, Macaulay is not a product that the supply is able to uh, fulfill the demand all over the world. Number two, Dalmore 62 Single Highland Malt Scotch, Matheson 1942, $58,000. Alexander Matheson built what would become the legendary Dalmore Distillery back in 1839. In 1942, this particular Scotch whiskey was released by Dalmore to honor Matheson. Just 12 bottles were made, which is part of what makes Matheson 1942 Dalmore Scotch so expensive. Inside is an exquisite whiskey that's bold and unlike any other. You'll have to find this one at a private collector's auction, and if you do expect to pay $58,000 or more. 40% ABV, unfortunately, they do not tell about not coloring it. But I would suggest if they color. Uh... Number three, the Balavini, 50 year old, $50,000. Last year, the Balavini unveiled its second ever 50 year old expression. At a retail price of $38,000, only about a dozen decanters of Marriage 0197 made their way to the States, all but guaranteeing an instant gouging on the secondary market. Surprisingly though, you can still procure one at a price that's not instinguently beyond suggested retail. Bottled at 42% ABV, it is rich and redolent of dark fruits with the honey-eyed spice finish. Number 4. Glenn Fittich, 1937, $71,700. Glenn Fittich, 1937, is a very rare single malt scotch whiskey with interesting, rich notes of molasses, chocolate, cedar, burnt heather, and oak. Its composition is exquisite, and this particular vintage was drawn from a cask that was made in 1937, hence the name. That same cask has been cared for by generations since, and the Glen Fittich 1937 still stands as an example of one of the best whiskeys in the world. In the nearly 80 years since Glen Fittich 1937 was made, only about 60 bottles remain and all can only be found at auction. Number 5, Gordon and MacPhail, Generations Mortal Latch 75 years old, $32,000. This is probably the best bargain on the list. In 2015, the re-owned independent bottler out of Elgin, Scotland, released the world's oldest single malt. Three quarters of a century spent in the first fill sherry resulted in 44.4% ABV whiskey with the brilliant auburn luster and exceptional notes of ranchio and candied plums. It sits in a custom teardrop shaped crystal decanter. Shell out just over $30,000 for one time offering and you'll even get a leather veil to transport it in. Number six, Springbank 1919, $78,000. Springbank 1919 is one of the few bottles of whiskey that's more than 50 years old that you can buy online. One prestigious retailer, the Whiskey Exchange, has it and will ship it to your front door. You're much more likely to find it at an auction, and you'll probably have no luck seeing it at your local wine and spirits store. At one time, Springbank 1919 was listed in the Guinness Book of Records as being the most expensive whiskey in the world. As you'll see on the list, that has changed. What hasn't changed, however, is the fact that Springbank 1919 is one of the most coveted whiskeys on the planet. Number 7. Isabel's Islay, $6.2 million. Isabel Islay's value is all tied up in its decanter, which contains 8,500 diamonds, 300 rubies, and exquisite white gold. Put water in the bottle, and it will be worth over $6 million. As far as whiskey goes, it's one of the finest that money can buy. 
decanter aside, Isabelle's Islay is the epitome of luxury Scott Whiskey. And even without a diamond and jewel encrusted bottle, it costs a ton of money on its own. Number 8, Bowmore, 1964, Black Bowmore, The Last Cast, $75,000. When the Black Bowmore series was launched back in 1994, the single malt landscape was radically different than it is today. This is the liquid that helped change the game. The original, a 30 year old offering, retailed at just $100 a bottle. 24 years later, that same release sold for $17,000 at auction. Matured entirely in its first fill sherry cask, the final deterioration didn't arrive until 2017. With unexpected aromas of pineapple and tropical themed sweetness, it drinks quite unlike any other Islay whiskey you'll ever taste. That's assuming you'll ever taste it. That's all for today. I hope you liked the video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel so that you never miss an amazing video from us.